I had a debate this week about excluding brand terms from PMAX. I'd say there's no definitive answer for everyone on this matter. Any opinion? You're 100% right. It's a good rule of thumb. If you can't tell me where that person originally came from, you can't exclude it. Hold on. So if you don't have the line of sight from an attribution perspective to understand, even though they converted on brand, they came from here, no excluding brand. You can't. You're right. You don't know if you're going to get them otherwise. Or how much money did you spend bringing them to the final 99 yard line out of 100 before you said, right. no, now I'm going to hide. So a better version is to run a feed only campaign, which is usually heavy brand. And then the other campaign campaigns have cold traffic and now you have your own little mini funnel and then you can have a high CPA or high to row as goal on your feed only campaign, but your cold traffic campaign is free to do with it what it pleases. So don't try to take your one campaign and chunk it out, separate them and make one more attractive to Google. All of your data in one PMAX, none of your data in another PMAX. Google will say, okay, this brand's going here. Okay, this is not brand's going there. You can see what you're doing. So yeah, I have scenarios that is yes and no, but it's all dependent upon all these other aspects. So good rule of thumb. Can't tell me where it came from. Can't exclude it because you're not doing yourself any favors.